Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the Disneyland Paris vlogs that have been up. Um, if you haven't watched them, I'll leave the link in the description to those vlogs. I'm currently on my first day um, in the parks, but I wanted to record a separate snack video of me trying some new snacks that are in Disneyland Paris. So I've just come to a little hidden corner, literally a little bench, just by um, the Last Chance Cafe, which is just through there. Um, and just by Big Thunder Mountain, in between the Silver, uh, in between the Steakhouse and the Lucky Nugget Sagoon. Sagoon Saloon. Um, it's so busy and so warm outside, so I'm just getting a bit of shade. And I thought I would be able to film in this little corner um, without being surrounded by people. So let's have a little look at what I've got. Okay, so first snack was these nems they're called but i think they're just like spring rolls they were eight euros which i think is very expensive for three i was going to get the caramel chicken and rice but i'm just too hot to eat a whole meal um so yeah so i got the pork nems and then i got the pineapple beignets which i am really really excited to try and these were six euros i believe um so you get two in there so i'm really excited to try those so I've just taken my first bite of um, the pork nem and it was so yummy. This is like the inside, if it's gonna focus. But you get the little chili sauce with it, so I'm just gonna try it with that now. Mm. Mm. That's really good. My verdicts on these are about seven out of 10. They are good, um, but for the price, I just don't think it's worth it. Next up, we have got the pineapple fritters beignets. Um, I'm dressed as Tiana today, so eating beignets seems fitting. Uh, they've got like a sugary coating on, and they look and smell really good, so. Mm. The inside is like chunky pineapple. I actually really like those because I love pineapple. I thought it was going to be like a puree though, so if you're thinking like it's going to be a smooth, like a jam filling, but with pineapple it's not, it's chunky. Mm. I would definitely get those again. A few inches later. The Disney Railroad has just whizzed past me whilst I have found a bin. If you know, you know, a park bin, a trash can for my snack that I've just got. Did I need one? No. But uh, I want to try as many new snacks as I can. This was a salted caramel chocolate brownie, hazelnut chocolate brownie from the cool posts or the outpost. Or I might have just completely made all of that up. Um, I'll put whatever it is on the screen. Um, and it was six euros, so I'm going to give this a whirl now. Okay, so it's quite hard initially to bite, to bite, to cut into they've got to give you a wooden spoon i hate wooden cutlery but mm. Mm. that is really nutty mm. really nutty mm. really i'm gonna get more caramel sauce this time got chocolate it's quite claggy that is really yummy not overly wowed by it like i wouldn't be like oh my gosh i need to try that again it's really yummy and i love nuts and hazelnuts and caramel so this was a win for me really um but it's not something i'm gonna rush back to like a cake pop which i haven't had yet so i'll definitely get one of those tomorrow or later on um but yeah for six euros quite a good snack something new here and yeah i would actually recommend it Day two. Okay guys, so new snack, new day. This morning I've got the cheese and ham croissant from Rosalie. I got it from the little desk that you can get uh, outside. And I've got myself a cappuccino as well because I need the coffee. Um, so yeah, I'm just sat here. The views are immaculate. Got a view of the big hot air balloon and it is hot today. I think it's already 22 degrees um, and it's only just gone half 11. So yeah, let's try this. My verdict on the croissant 
it's absolutely divine it's boiling hot i don't think it was going to be boiling hot because they were in a, a glass cabinet i thought they might have been made earlier this morning um and they were just sitting there and they might have been cooler now but it's boiling hot the cheese is so nice the ham is so nice and the pastry if you know me you know i love a pastry so this is a 10 out of 10 for me the only downfall is how hot this table is and i want to like lean and just eat because it's got all the cheese and goodness in but it's flaking everywhere so <laughs> i need to um just take a moment to devour this i think it was eight euros which is obviously expensive but definitely worth it because it's got so much cheese in i can't even explain like, how much cheese it's got in it and the ham so yummy definitely recommend so let's head inside and see what they've got Wow, they've got loads to choose from. Cheesecake. Oh, it all looks really good. What to get? So I've got the sweet, I've got the carrot cake from the Kiri Bake Shop on Main Street. This was four euros and I'm just sat in front of the castle waiting for the parade. So let's give this a go. I love carrot cake. Yeah. Like two out of five. My next snack, new snack to try is this cheese pretzel. I got it from the little stand over there, that pink one, and it was six euros. It is warmed up as well, so hopefully it's gonna be really tasty. I'm a happy gal. That is really yummy. Mm. It's like salty, cheesy, warm. Everything you want it to be. Day three. Hello everyone, so it's day three. Day three, first snack is my breakfast, which is the Rice crispy Treat from the Boardwalk Cat Palace. I don't think this is gonna be like Florida ones, so I've heard, um, but I still wanted to give it a try, so. Oh, that was a lot harder on my teeth than I thought. surprised by that. I thought it was going to be really dry. That's a four out of five for me. I'm just waiting for stars on parade so I'm just going to sit here. Got me coffee. And wait to watch the show. I thought it seemed fitting to end the snack video outside of the Boardwalk Candy Palace. I did just buy some snacks to take home. I bought some fudge because I know that my the boys at my house love fudge. And I also got a cake pop because I haven't actually had one this trip yet. Um, and there was one left, so I grabbed that for the train home. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the yummy snack content. Um, I love filming it, obviously, all the snacks and it was good to try some new ones as well but there's loads more that I didn't get to try the pineapple whip the uh, cocoa churros and much more so uh, if you're coming to Disneyland Paris anytime soon anytime soon uh, enjoy yourselves, get all the snacks immerse yourselves in all the fun and I hope you have the best this time and thank you so much for watching big love what a wonderful